Hundreds of middle schoolers in Waco ISD met their teachers for the first time today. That's right, and students and their parents got the chance to explore the campus, some for the very first time. Fox 44's PJ Hessner went to check out the excitement at Tennyson Middle School tonight and joins us live in the studio. PJ, what was the purpose of the meet and greet? Thanks, MG. Well, students received their schedules, met their teachers, and reunited with friends. They also got to see what a typical school day will look like. The first day of school is filled with anxiety for both students and parents. It's a hard age for kids, um, and making friends can be difficult. For incoming sixth graders, it's a whole new lifestyle. We're talking about middle school students, it's a huge transition for sixth graders moving from elementary to middle school. So tonight, Tennyson Middle School students and their parents were invited to a meet and greet. I am very excited about um, the new school and um, they're obviously very, very welcoming. It serves as a way for students to get familiar with their new schedule. We want them to feel comfortable and they want, want them to feel at ease and know that this is a safe place to come and that we are here to help them get to class the first day. And if they have any questions, that, they, that we are here to help them. It's also for parents to express concerns. One of my concerns has been the clear backpacks. I don't, I, I don't really care for the idea and don't really think that it's the answer. And for administration to assist with registration, file students shot records and make sure proof of residency documents are uploaded. A lot of parents uh, think that they're completely registered and they're showing up to find out that they're missing information. So we want to make sure it's a smooth first day of school. If you weren't available to come tonight, you can pick up your child's schedule at the front office of their Waco ISD school anytime this week. In the studio, PJ Hessner, Fox 44 News.